guys, welcome back. I have kind of a small haul for you and I'm just we're just gonna chat a little bit because I'm in that kind of a mood. Yeah, I'm in that kind of mood. Uh, I've gotten some recent products from companies I want to mention and some stuff from friends and that kind of stuff. So I'm all just gonna, like I'm just gonna kind of put it all in the haul. You know, just put it all in the haul, right? Okay. Um, oh, I want to mention this first. Okay. I got this right before I went on vacation. Danny had sent it to me. Uh, Danny sent me like a, a little package I want to show you guys actually. Um, uh, this is from Boom F and I thought this was so cute. It's called Magic Mash Marshmallows and this is so adorable. This and it's I think it's a really great idea for a, a gift for a holiday so that's why I wanted to mention it real quick. It's actually a company that will take pictures that you send them and will put the face or whatever picture it is on marshmallows. So I thought that was a really really cute idea and <laughs> it was just so funny when I opened this up and I was like what is that? Is, is that Lily's paw? <laughs> So um, these are actually the pictures that um, Danny had sent is a picture of me and her from IMATS and from um, Actually, these are both from the Knicks party and then Lily's paw. It was so cute And uh, this came right before I went to California a couple weeks ago And I kept forgetting to mention it to you guys. So I wanted to tell you really quick so adorable You know what? I'm actually just gonna start with the little gift pack. I just got from her actually my Buffalicious is so good to me. She sent me this little package and um, she had bought me this glitter from the makeup show and it's really pretty. It's kind of this, <laughs> it's funny, she called it, it was so ugly, it was pretty, but it, it's, I could understand why she said that. It's kind of this greenish, purplish, goldish glitter and you can, can't really even see it and uh, it's, it's by from Violet Ball. So that's what the glitter looks like. You guys can kind of see it a little bit better. It is so... Fantastic. I can't wait to do a look with this. You guys know I'm I'm a glitter holic. I was oogling her Ipsy sparkly bag and I sent her a text. I'm like, if you have eight million of those bags, you need to send me one. And she does. She because she's been doing Ipsy for so long, she has so many little makeup bags. So I kind of got her to send me this one because it was like glittery rific and I was like, Can you send that to me if <laughs> she did. She sent it to me. She's so sweet. But inside uh, the package, she actually sent me her lip color, which is uh, done by ColourPop, and it's called Frida, and it looks like this. It's actually on my lips right now. I couldn't help but wear it. It's so pretty. I'm, I'm going to put more on because I'm obsessed. Mm, it's this beautiful, corally, pink, neutral color. I really love it. She sent me the matching lip liner. I don't know how, but the cap fell off, and I can't find it. So I'm very worried about smushing this. I have to find another cap that I can put on this. Only me, only me would lose the cap to a brand new lip liner. Oh my gosh. So it does match perfectly. I'll swatch it just in case my lips aren't enough for you guys. Once, there it is. Very, very beautiful. I've never tried any of these ColourPop lippy sticks before and the lip liner matches perfectly. It's a tiny bit matte and the formula is a little bit um, a little glossier just a tiny bit it's not really gloss but it's like satin finish when you add the lip liner with the lipstick it just gives the most beautiful finish oh i love it i love it i love it yeah let me shush my hair a little bit my hair's getting a little flat nobody likes that okay okay uh the she sent me some mosquito lashes uh these are the voila lash really super pretty i love it Danny swears by Esquito, and she also sent me these, and they're called Unforgettable, and they look like this. Same kind of thing, but just a little floody. Like, one's a little bit thicker than the other, so they're really super pretty. So, that's my little gifties from the bestie. Okay. I got a package from Lit Glitter, and I was really excited. They sent me a bunch of glitter to try out, and uh, they sent me actually seven glitters, which are absolutely friggin stunning uh, they sent me afternoon delight and hello sunshine which right now I am hosting a giveaway with these two glitters while uh, two people can win actually I'll put the link to the giveaway below and they did actually send me some other glitters that they are currently sending that they're currently selling at Sephora so um, their Superfly which is a really beautiful holographic glitter it's, it's hard to see glitter through stacks. Uh, this is a purple glitter, a gold glitter, a champagne, and a tinsel. So I will list the names of these glitters, these glitters, down in the description bar. So I was really, really thankful. Thank you so much, Lit, for sending me these products. And you guys know I am a glitter bomb, so I will be doing tons of tutorials with glitter. You know I love glitter. 
I have gotten some nail polishes lately at Bed Bath & Beyond because I have a serious problem. Uh, there is a holiday pack I found from... Wait, did I mention this already? No, I didn't. Okay. I mentioned on Instagram, I found a five pack from um, SC and it has five minis, which these minis are so cute. And I don't know if you guys noticed, but in Walgreens, they're selling the minis now for $5 each. Yeah. So I got a five pack of minis, which has uh, five beautiful colors. It's this kind of grayish purple and then this light pink which I'm actually wearing on my nails right now and then this blue this mauvey kind of purple and then this glitter so this is a really good deal it's $15 for five and um, so actually you're getting two free if you're buying individual anyways and um, you can use your Bed Bath & Beyond coupon so I only wound up paying ten so it's two dollars a nail polish score uh, I also got this color from Essie, which I'm wearing on my fingernails right now. Let me show you my fingernails. Okay, this is what my fingernails are looking like right now. I did a little polka dot manicure and I put this copper glitter right on top. So you guys know I can't resist a, 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 a polka dot manicure with some glitter. Ugh, yeah, so that's what it looks like. It is so pretty. I just, I love this color so much. I made a purchase online at Sephora right at the end of the um, of the sale, you know, right before. Actually, the sale was still going on like 24 hours the next day after it expired, but it was going on online. I guess they had some problems on the internet, so I did get a few things. Guess what's on Sephora's website now? Ha ha, lime crime! So I did pick this up. I was so depressed that I did not get this at IMATS. I don't know why I didn't. Everybody else got it but me. So I went ahead and got the Velveteen in Wicked. Let's bust this little bad boy out. I don't know why I put it back in the box knowing I was going to show you guys. I have almost all the other Velveteens. There's a new one coming out that's mauve that I'm going to obviously need. And, I, you know, I just, I love them so much. So Wicked is this beautiful oxblood color. Looks like that. Oh, it dries down to a matte formula. It doesn't budge. I find them a little bit drying, but if you can tolerate that, the pigmentation is absolutely beautiful. The application's a little messy, honestly. You have to be very, very careful because this is so liquidy. You could really mess up your lip line really hella quick with this. I gotta be honest. I got two of the uh, NARS Audacious Lipsticks. I got this one in Olivia. Beautiful kind of burnt orange, red kind of color. I do have a Let's Try It On coming should be sometime this week, actually. The Let's Try It On is probably going to be before this video, as a matter of fact. And uh, I also got this color in Betts, which is a couple shades darker. I know you guys are going to be like, Sam, seriously, same color. But I swear to you, they're not. They're not the same color. Um, oh, okay, so I got those two audacious lipsticks from Sephora as well. I went to Bloomingdale's to place an order for this this product for a, a Christmas gift and this is El Agua but I did find it for myself as well um, the color looks like this you guys know that I was going crazy because I did not have this with Anna and I was just so upset so I finally did get my hands on this if you go into Bloomingdale's they can order it for you you can't get it online and this is sold out everywhere you just can't find it anywhere so I did finally get El Agua by NARS I'm so excited the color is just dreamy and perfect it's perfect. While I was in Bloomingdale's, I was just spritzing around the perfumes and I came home and Matt was like, what are you wearing? You've never smelled better. So I was like, okay. Well, I it was called Chanel Chance and he was like, you need to get that perfume right now. I actually got the smallest version of it because when I get a perfume for the first time, I don't know how the longevity of the perfume is going to be and how I'm gonna like it in the long run. So I always wind up getting the smallest bottle. This is the one point two fluid ounces yeah 1.2 fluid ounces it's the pink one this perfume is absolutely dreamy uh i love it so much it smells like it smells luxurious it's young and flirty and men seem to love it everyone that i've spoken to about this lip uh, about this perfume their men have gone crazy over this i don't know if it has some sort of pheromones in it but this is a great perfume so i'm pretty happy to have that now i did get like so many samples from Sephora lately. I got um, some Gucci Flora perfume. I got some uh, Hane Mori perfume. I don't know. I've never heard of it. So if you guys have heard of any of these perfumes, you have to tell me if you like them. Cartier Declaration. 
And you guys, let's see what else I got. Oh, I got another Flora by Gucci. And then I got a whole bunch of Glam Glow samples and all this. You know, I have to get myself some new Glam Glow because mine dried out a while ago and I had not gotten a new one. Huh. I finally got this in the mail. Oh, this only took like 18 years. While I was in San Francisco, I wound up getting this. This is one of the pigment sets from MAC and I bought it before it was actually available and then they sent it to me, but they forgot to send it to me. So I actually waited like three weeks to get this. And this finally came, oops, this finally came in the mail and this is the pink one and it's got rose pigment, which I already have, but it has some new glitters and it's just so pretty. And this was really inexpensive. I think it was like $35. So I was really excited to get my hands on this. I wasn't originally going to get it, but I wound up getting it because I can't resist. And it's, look this pretty packaging. I had to get it. So pretty. Yeah. Don't forget, I'm also going to put a link for the lit giveaway, which is probably still open at this point because I think I'm ending it a week from Monday. So that's it. That's into December. So it should still be open now. So if you guys are interested in winning your own lit kit, then that will be below. Well, I hope you guys enjoyed this haul video. If you did, just go ahead and give me a big thumbs up. Subscribe to my channel if you haven't already, and I'll see you guys in the next video. Bye, guys.